Okay, we're on problem number two. It's an integration problem. And let's write it down. What is it going to be? Cosine of 2x. And the bottom is sine x plus cosine x. Now, granted, it's easy to get stuck in things. You start to realize that these problems will work if you move forward on it. And the first thing I would look at is, uh, you know, the cosine of 2x. I, I know an identity for that. And I'll write that down for you. The cosine of 2x is the cosine squared x minus the sine squared of x. All right? But also I notice about that, I could factor that into cosine x minus sine x times cosine x plus sine x. All right, I think I'm ready to write this down now. And I'm doing a simplification now. The top actually factors into cosine x minus sine x times cosine x plus sine x. And the bottom, I'm going to put a factor symbol on it, sine x plus cosine x. Now, additions are commutative, so this factor here and this factor here are identical. So what am I left off with? Something pretty simple. I'm left off with cosine of x minus the sine of x dx. I need to integrate. Uh, the antiderivative of cosine is sine. And the antiderivative of sine is going to be minus cosine, so minus and minus is plus. Put a box in this. And again, my recommendation is, you know, certainly look back over your work, certainly make sure it looks good. But my recommendation is also look at the answer k to see if you're staring at this answer over here. And we are staring at the answer. There's also work listed for you. Thank you.